As important as home-cooked healthy eating is, sometimes it's the cooking that can be intimidating, especially for young adults. So today we're joined by the authors of the Hot Mess Kitchen Cookbook, Gabby Moskowitz and Miranda Berman. Welcome, Hello. ladies. I can tell you two have fun together doing we this, have, don't we, you? We have a lot of fun. Do you together. go way back, you two? Or? No. no. Actually, we met on the internet. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. a little so oh, real oh, nice. fashion. We met a few years ago. Um, our friend BJ Novak from The Office had a really cool app called List, and um, I was writing recipes. Miranda was writing just like funny jokes lists and stuff. Yeah, I'm a yeah. comedy writer. And, and you could request a list from each other. So I would request recipes from Gabby, like easiest home cooked meal to trick someone into falling in love with you, things like that. And we started. I like it. Yeah. So, so food and comedy writer join yeah. mm -hmm. to create a hot mess kitchen. Yeah, okay. exactly. We love it. Thank you. And I love it because you brought some wonderful recipes here with yeah. you today. Good. And no good segment starts without a beverage it's, in it's hand. It's cocktail time. Mm -hmm. So what it's do we have always here? Cocktail time. Man. There you go. <laughs> this is what we call a, a bad bitch margarita. Whoa. <laughs> it's it's kind of our take on a, a less sugary margarita. I grew up, my dad made margaritas all the time and they were very strong. And so now whenever I go out, I ask for a dry margarita. They assume I'm asking for a low carb margarita, but I'm not trying to be skinny. I'm just trying to get drunk, really. So <laughs> oh, that is nice. <laughs> but at the end of the day, it actually is much healthier. It was, we don't add anything except for fresh orange juice. There's no added sugar. And Th This is the way I would like to drink. Can I be a bad bitch? For sure. Please. You, you yes. have to be a bad bastard. Well, that's the point. That's that's tasty. I love it. it's it's the the lime and the tequila flavors as opposed to just pure sugar. So yeah. and I see some wings here. Yes, yes. Buffalo wings are really popular. They're often deep fried, which makes them really crispy. Um, we these are sriracha baked wings mm. that are absolutely delicious. We use sriracha instead of Tabasco. You can use any hot sauce you like, but we love the sriracha. And then we bake them, which gets them nice and crispy, and uh, we don't add any sugar, and we don't think that they need it. And the hot wings belong in a hot mess kitchen. Mm -hmm. yeah, I, I, I love the kick. Just, I, just the right amount right. of kick. Just enough that I need to get back to my bad bitch margarita for a little cool off. That's the idea. Delicious. So you're moving on, and, and we've got two, I'm going to call them potentially main dish meals. Yes, yeah, yeah, certainly. Tell us what we got here. So um, this is a fabulous chili. We call it Netflix and chili con carne. And we add uh, cocoa to it, which is unsweetened dark chocolate cocoa, which uh, is full of antioxidants and really delicious. I love adding cocoa in surprising places, mm -hmm. but I love a good curry too. Yeah, well, the great thing about both of these dishes is you can make them in the beginning of the week and then they stay good. So you could eat them for the whole weekend mm -hmm. with every movie of the week. Mm. Yeah. Mm. And, and this, is, this is a paleo curry? Yeah, it's called paleo pain in the butt curry. <laughs> <laughs> for when you have your friends over and they give you their dietary restrictions and you're like, oh man. I'm allergic to this I'm and that's too to many that. calories. Right. But that is delicious. So this is cauliflower substitute for rice, right? Yeah, right. And it, it is rice. a winner. Yes. Yeah, it is, it is a winner. And Hot Mess Kitchen, I must say, ladies, seems to be a winner. And the best part, it's available everywhere books are sold. Everyone in the audience, though, today Woo! is going home with a copy. These really are great. I'm going to use these recipes. 